Joining me right now is the newest head coach of the newest pro franchise in Omaha, the UFL's Omaha Nighthawks. The Nighthawks? That's right. What happened to bug eaters? What happened to Mustangs? What happened to zombies? Well, let me tell you something. We had over 9,000 people submit a name for this team, and we came up with Nighthawks, and it's named after the stealth bomber. Not bad. Not bad at all. Because you promised at your initial press conference to bomb away, so to speak. You got that right. We're going to go ahead and make this look fun, and it's going to be a lot of, uh, a lot of entertainment for our fans. And when you think about it, the promotional campaigns are endless. I think so. I think so. I mean, you can do a lot with uh, the stealth bomber. I said we might have one fly over, and you're <laughs> going to be the pilot. That's right. I got to be the pilot, and what are you going to be? Uh, I'll be the one telling you what to do. That's right, because you're a head coach. <laughs> That's exactly right. You're going to coach at least 20 players that we know of, 20 more on a list that has yet to be disclosed. We do. We have our first 20. We've got them on a, on a UFL website on who we've got. We just signed today Keith Eloy right. from the Nebraska Omaha. We're really excited about him. And as you and I were talking about earlier, skill guy in your offense this day and age in the modern pro game, you got to get the ball in your playmaker's hands. You, yes, you do. And we're, we're going to find a way to do that. We're going to find a way to put those guys in position to succeed. What about Huskers? I mean, this is big red nation, as you know. Any Huskers on the team? That's been asked for weeks. Uh, we're going to have a couple on our team, but I can't tell you who oh, they are right now. I mean, now what is it about this fledgling league? You can never tell us anything. Well, we, we want to keep everybody interested in it. Right. And I tell you, we're going to have a lot of fun with it. I tell you, it will be a, a fun league to watch. A lot of talent as well. A lot of former players from the NFL that maybe didn't get their chance, that were maybe injured just on the cusp. And a lot of big-time former college players. There are. We've got a for former first-round pick going to be on a team. A lot of these guys, about 80% of them have been on NFL rosters. What are the chances? you got a tryout camp in Omaha Central the 15th. What are the chances that you're going to get a guy or two from that bunch? I think there's going to be a real good chance. There's a lot of guys out there that never got their shot, and we're going to give them. It's not going to be just like a run your 40 time and you're done. We're going to work these guys out. It's going to be an NFL-type style combine. Yes, I heard you say it. it is going to be like a combine. Right. These guys can walk away saying, I really did get a fair shake. Absolutely. And I would tell you, the guys and the other teams in this league that have had tryout, they've had like 200, 250 players at it. So there's a lot of guys out there that want to get a shot. All right. Now you're a coach who's always looking for a shot, a nomadic life, so to speak, from the pros to college to here. Just like you guys. That's right. <laughs> Are you looking eventually to get your shot back to the NFL, much like the players? No, I tell you what, I'm going to be happy where I am. I've got a great staff. i got to pick everybody in my whole organization. And I picked all guys that I knew personally right. or guys that, that recommended that I knew. Plus, as we talked about, you're a Wisconsin guy. So here in the Midwest, yeah. quite simply, Husker Nation, he gets it. Yeah, and so are the fans here. Uh, I talked to Bo Pelini, and he said that they'll let you know if you made the right call or wrong call. <laughs> Come on, what else does Bo say? He says this is a great place to coach, and I'm really looking forward to it. Well, I'll tell you what, we're looking forward to it as well, Jags. Great. Thanks for coming in. So there you go, the Omaha Nighthawks. Nighthawks, and we'll be back with some more sports coming up right after the break.